friends in the PC world, more is usually better. There are some instances where more is not like if you had three of me. One is certainly enough Bretts for the world. It, that's right, just one. Get rid of all of the other Bretts in the world and that would, would be beautiful right there. Which is why I'm excited today to talk about more. More! More monitors. More monitors on a laptop. My friends, I introduce you to the Hydra the triple monitor laptop setup for our editor who's returning to South Africa. Okay, well, well, you're not supposed to hold it. That's generally the idea. But before we talk about the monstrosity that is the Hydro laptop, let's go ahead and talk about what's not a monstrosity. Today's video sponsor. My friends, today's video is brought to you by the chair that I am sitting on. This is the Ewin Flash XL gaming chair. It's ergonomic, it's got pillows, and it is XL, as they say, can hold up to 550 pounds for its max load, which is just bananas. It's called the XL because if you compare it to the previous EUN chair that they sponsored us with, it is just large. My goodness, this is great for anybody who needs some extra width when they sit in a chair, which I personally prefer because it gives me room to kind of slide around. Or again, it has that max weight capacity in case you need it over standard gaming chairs. And on top of that, it's got all the features you would expect in a gaming chair. And it's super duper comfy with their cold cure foam, which is two times heavier than regular foam per cubic foot, which gets it close to memory foam territory. Ewin makes some of my favorite comfy gaming chairs. It's got all of the adjustments that you can need for leaning back, as well as for adjusting the armrest. They've got large durable soft glide casters that make hardly a noise when you slide around on the floor and will also not damage the surface beneath the chair. So go ahead and check out the link in the video description and you can use coupon code UFD to save 30% off for the month of November on the Flash XL. It's a large chair, it's large in my heart, and you can save a large discount, 30% off using code UFD, check them out. So this is a concept that came out from Mobile Pixo's Trio. Now this might look familiar because there's been other concepts like this done before. Most notoriously, notoriously, most notoriously is the one where Linus stole it from, I believe it was Razor's booth at CES back in whatever part of the year that didn't have a pandemic going on. However, Mobile Pixels wants to do something where you can do that for all laptops. And they've created something that I'm very excited. But let me first set the stage for why we actually need something like this. Why wouldn't you just get extra monitors? Well, it's very clear that this is for somebody who's going to be on the road a lot and needs to have extra screen real estate. One of the benefits of the Trio by Mobile Pixels is the fact that when you condense it all down, it doesn't take up a wider footprint than your just your laptop. You can actually simplify it to be in a compact space that's going to still fit in a backpack. In our specific scenario, Catlin's moving back to South Africa, which is a country that has something known as load shedding, which is where the government turns off the power because they can't supply enough to all residents at the same time, which leads to us, when we were back in SA, moving our entire production studio over to a Starbucks in a different part of town that still had power so that we could continue to edit our videos. It was a fun time. It was sometimes happened for 12 hours a day. It was lovely. This will allow her to do that and have the most badass setup at a Starbucks ever possible. I was insanely excited when Mobile Pixels asked me if I wanted to try out this setup and you could actually even just have it as a singular extra monitor in case you want. Now, this is a typical portable monitor scenario where it's powered over USB and the video signal is delivered over USB. So you're not going to get low response times on the panels because it's actually sending it all over USB. So my guess is, I'm not able to verify this independently, I'm guessing that it's probably in the 25 to 35 millisecond response time, which is not great for gaming, but while they do kind of market it as a Switch product on their website, you really don't want to be using this for PC gaming, but rather for what we intend to use it for. Mobile video editing, being able to have your bins of your project folders, your Lumetri scopes on the other side, and being able to create a 
environment where you have all of the desired workspace that you could possibly need while on the go. But fortunately, also with this setup, it's easily removable. It attaches via an adhesive to a magnet on the back. And when you don't want to have it there, such as when you're actually at home with other monitors, you just pop it off the magnet. And there you go. You have a clean laptop, but you still have the little magnet stickers on the back. However, those magnets are sturdy enough to hold it for the most part. I haven't found that the monitors slide off even in the triple setup. You can have it in the singular setup where you only have one monitor coming off to the side because you just slide it out in case you want the dual monitor situation. But the main key point that gets me excited is the rail system that the trios have, which allow you to slot two together and then pull them out across to create the monstrosity of the triple laptop. As far as viewing angles, they're good enough. Brightness, 300 nits, which is is all you need 60 hertz refresh rate doesn't have any weird ghosting or trail issues like you would find on other cheap portable monitors but while we're talking about the price this does come in as an expensive solution the trio itself is 260 dollars right now 300 dollars normally and you need to buy two of them in order to get this triple screen monitor setup which means you're at least 520 if not 600 dollars out in order to get this so it's a very niche product especially with the price point that you're coming in at however it does solve a problem that actually we've had in the past now you can also get the trio max which comes in at 14 inches which is going to cost you 310 dollars normally 360 which will give you 14 inches of screen real estate and they say is better for 15 and 17 inch monitors i'd happen to agree they sent us the regular trios because i asked for that because i didn't know which laptop catlin would be going home with and that's a 12 and a half inch screen and it feels a little small on the 15.6 inch CyberPower PC that we're sending Catlin home with, which you can check out our review of right up there, but it gets the job done. And honestly, a losing an inch and a half isn't gonna be such a deal breaker when you're adding two 12 and a half inch monitors on the side of a laptop. This honestly is a solution to a problem that we had. I actually really, really love this. I wish I had it when we were in South Africa. Everything about the system works phenomenally well. Everything slides in the rail system. I haven't had any issues with it so far. Everything runs off of the included USB-C cable, which obviously does introduce a little bit of cable clutter, but that's the price you have to pay in case you're trying to power external displays. Honestly, I love it. I'm kind of jealous that Catlin gets it, but although I'm not necessarily jealous of the fact that she's going to have to use it during load shedding, but I wish we had this two years ago when we were still in South Africa, where on Christmas Eve, we were running over to Starbucks because our power actually got stolen that time, not load shedding. So this is a solution to a problem I definitely had. It's a great solution by Mobile Pixels. It is a little bit more expensive, but I think this would have been a justifiable business expense had I had to purchase it, but Mobile Pixels indeed did send it over to us. So that's me checking out what I'm calling the Hydro Laptop. This is going home with Catlin to South Africa. She's gonna be able to do all of that. We're gonna get her an actual monitor for her home setup, but for when she needs to go out and about, she's gonna have all the screen real estate. And again, be the coolest kid at Starbucks. Big thanks to Mobile Pixels for sending over both of the trios and big thanks to today's video sponsor don't forget that today's video is brought to you by ewin's flash xl gaming chair it's still down from before you check it out at the link in the video description use coupon code ufd to save 30 percent off that's gonna wrap up the video hit the like button if you enjoyed it get subscribed to stay up to date on all of our tech related content we'll have a lot more coming out in the near future especially once recent catlin gets settled in sa and i'll see you in the next video cheers Which is why today I'm excited to talk about more monitors, specifically. Frick.